One of my favorite desserts is Bananas Foster. When I go to a fancy restaurant, I love to see it made table side, typically with butter and dark rum and brown sugar. And then in a very dramatic fashion, it's lit on fire. That process is called flambe. We're going to take all those great flavors and transfer it to the breakfast table. But we're not making any pancakes. That's too hard. We're going to buy them frozen. That's the easy part. And we're going to make a great sauce. Now, we've already melted some butter here on top of this skillet. To that, we're going to add some light brown sugar. And that's going to immediately begin to break down into that beautiful unsalted butter. Now, don't worry, there's no flame in this dish. We're going to incorporate all the great flavors and leave the danger out of it. To that, I'm going to add some dark rum, because again, we want all those same great, rich, complex flavors. Then some cinnamon. And then to give it a little extra banana flavor, some banana extract which you'll buy in the supermarket. Now, let's give this a bit of a stir, incorporate all those ingredients, be patient with this, work with it over low heat, and keep stirring it until it thickens. Now, it's been about four or five minutes, and you can see that the sauce is now beginning to caramelize and thicken beautifully. It's turned that rich, rich brown color. A lot of the harsh alcohol smell has burned off. So what we've got now is a really beautiful and flavorful sauce. But these are bananas foster pancakes. So it's in time for us to add in the sliced bananas. Now, spoon these in a little at a time. Remember that sauce is very, very hot. So let's get these in. Everyone into the pool. Come on, no stragglers. Everybody inside. Now, once it's into the sauce, got one more there. Once it's into the sauce, very gently fold these over. Two things are going to happen here. We're going to coat each of the little bananas with this beautiful and flavorful sauce. Plus, it will help the bananas to start to soften just a bit before we spoon them or pour them over the pancakes. So now the bananas are into the sauce. They've all been coated. They soften just a bit. Let's pour these over those beautiful frozen pancakes we bought at the supermarket. Now, let me get a spoon here and just work this out. Be generous, let this completely cover your pancakes. A little extra sauce never hurt. We'll come over to this side and take care of these as well. Oh, what a perfect dessert this could make or a breakfast treat, either way. I think you could get away with either with something this decadent and this delicious and this easy, remember, because you're starting with those frozen pancakes. Saturday or Sunday morning breakfast or brunch will never be quite the same.